for somebody that really wants to wow everybody at the project fair. All right, why? Because A number one, you gotta go to Petland Discounts and you gotta get yourself some ants. Or you can just go outside and try to find them. Okay, but those are wild ants, you wanna be careful. And uh, what we're trying to find out is whether or not this ant likes sugar or cheese. In this case, I use Swiss cheese better. So the project says, do ants like cheese or sugar better? Well, you know, that's one of those cool projects where you get opportunity to work with an ant and all you really need is two pieces of material. You need a sh some sugar and a Swiss cheese. Now, the only way to find out is to take this ant, okay, and put it in a controlled environment, put a little sugar here and a piece of cheese here and see which the way the ant, the ant moves to. Now, more than likely, from my own history, if you ever had a, sh a soda or a, like a, a quarter drink and you dropped it on the floor in the summer, ants love sugar. Okay, so more than likely what you're going to see is that the ants gravitate towards the sugar. But the only way to do it, like I said, is to put the ant in a controlled environment, have the sugar here, the cheese here, put the ant right here, and see which way it goes. I mean, it's going to be a really good time, it's going to be a lot of fun, but just make sure your parents know that you're working with the ants. All right?